Good morning, Golf High. I'm Elizabeth. And I'm Mr. Rutherford, coming to you from WBUC Studios with your school news. The word of the day today is doff, which is a verb meaning to take off or remove. Can you use that in a sentence, Mr. Rutherford? I sure can, Elizabeth. Our guests doffed their coats when they came into the house. For lunch today, we will be having PB&J, grilled chicken Caesar salad, hamburger or cheeseburger, and calzones. And remember, breakfast and lunch is free every day. And now for today's weather forecast. It's going to be another rainy day with a high of 86 degrees with showers throughout the day as we have a 70% chance of rain. Stay dry and have a great day, Bucks. In 1945, Japan surrenders, bringing an end to World War II. In 1666, the Great Fire of London begins. And in 1969, the first ATM opens for business. In current news, three states in the Northeast have declared a state of emergency due to the remnants of Hurricane Ida. Newlyweds send bills to no-show guests for missing their reception. China bans kids from playing online video games during the week. Paralympian is stripped of gold medal for being three minutes late to the competition.
the joke of the day. Why did the pirate put a chicken on top of his treasure chest? Stay tuned to the end of the news for the answer. There will be a meeting today after school for anyone interested in joining the theater club. The meeting will be held in room 255. See Mr. Lopez if you have any questions. The girls volleyball team hosts Sun Lake tonight at home in the Beaver Hicks Activity Center. JV starts play at 6 p.m. followed by varsity at 7 p.m. Come out and cheer on our Lady Bucks. So, why did the pirate put a chicken on top of his treasure chest? Because eggs marks the spot. That's all for our news. Have, Have a, a great, great National, National Blueberry, Blueberry Popsicle, Popsicle Day, Day, Golf High. High.